I think it's very damaging to an institution which prides itself on, um, you know, leading the Commonwealth, on um, welcoming heads of state from all over the world, and um, has done a great deal in terms of charity work. You just need to look at the Prince of Wales and the Prince's Trust has done a lot uh, with young people of colour. And I think that they will be absolutely devastated and reeling from these accusations. We run from Kate made me cry to the family is racist and the, the discussions of how dark the baby's going to be, what shade of brown the baby's going to be. Look, that's a huge allegation and um, it's devastating for the royal family and I'm sure they will want to respond um, in time once they've had a chance to, to digest everything that's come through. Um, you know, that's something that's totally inexcusable if that's what happened. What good is going to come of it? it? Is it going to make them feel better? In the long term, I think probably not, because the what's about to flow out from this is, um, you know, using the live one other film. I think they've unleashed hell. Who did the, who did this interview help? Apart from the, you know, Harpo Productions and. Um, and the various broadcasters around the world. I mean, who has this helped? I think the very personal um, admissions about his family, um, the state of relationship with his father and with his brother, I think they will have been very upsetting for, for both his father and brother to hear. And, and also, you know, fairly damaging. So it will be interesting to see what comes out from Kensington Palace and from Clarence House over the course of the next few days. It's just an incredibly sad situation. He's made this huge decision, but um, you see at the same time, he's lost a great deal in the process.